Well, markets are quiet but crazy. What's up, everybody? Welcome aboard to Bubba's Eye Update for Tuesday. Welcome back from the long holiday weekend, and uh, hopefully you enjoyed yourself and uh, saluted some uh, some military personnel that have, you know, they didn't do it, but their ancestors helped us be the free country we are. And uh, uh, here we are with a market that is kind of sloppy, kind of all over the place, and we get some under big pressure and some under big rallies. In the meantime, it is overall quiet, and this update is brought to you by our friends and partners at the CTG Group, Capital Trading Group, as one of our brokers. Now, we have many other brokers that we use, but we prefer the CTG Group, Capital Trading, because A, they do a great job, they execute on time, they got great customer service, they've got great managed futures products, and they execute all my accounts. So, to me, it sounds like a, a great spot to be. And uh, we appreciate their efforts when and taking care of the members of, of, our, of our system. And, you know, again, I do have other brokers that I use, but for the most part, I prefer to use CTG. If you'd like some more information, just check them out at info.capitaltradinggroup.com forward slash Bubba. That's info.capitaltradinggroup.com forward slash Bubba. In the meantime, you got a market that is unbelievably all over the place. And we've been higher, we've been lower. But right now, you get the Dow under pressure down about 260. The NASDAQ is up about 50, S&P is down 18, and the Russell is down 345. So, again, we're long across the board, all three, and, you know, this is quiet, and this is not unexpected. I, maybe the, the moves are unexpected, but the quiet action is not. Uh, we are entering the most two, bullish two weeks of the year, uh, historically, which doesn't mean anything. Uh, but, you know, yeah, we'll see. We'll see what happens. This is the basically the beginning of the month, and uh, we'll see how it uh, trades out. In the meantime, we are along across the board. Uh, we did reverse the Dow this morning. And as we look at the metals, I mean, gold and silver are, are well, actually, silver has just turned lower. Uh, gold is up about 25 bucks after being up almost 35 bucks. So we'll see. I don't know. Is it going to be the end? Is it going to turn back over? That we don't know. We will see where it goes. In the meantime, we are still short, uh, although we could see that, you know, if this rally holds, that we could be potentially reversing. Uh, in the uh, crude oil, after reaching our target, we, we called it on the Monday night call, 7690 the last couple of weeks. And sure enough, it hit 7695 overnight, and now it's down to 7436 getting hammered. Okay. Uh, and, you know, again, that, that's one of the things that we want to remind you is that, you know, we, we were waiting for some key levels, and that is, where it came to. We are still long, of course. That has not changed. Uh, but it's interesting how the levels we were watching for came into play. Uh, copper, which is unbelievable, is up almost 12 cents overnight and is now down on the day, which is another key, ugly reversal, which indicates that copper is going to go lower. And we are, of course, short copper. Uh, net gas is slightly lower after being higher, and we are still long. Um, you know, it, it, it's something to look at. Platinum has come far off its highs as well. And we would be long platinum, but it is, it, it has, it looks pretty nasty right now. Now, we don't trade anymore because it is not liquid enough. And uh, the dollar is higher, which is no surprise. You know, as we, as we, as we warn you all the time, you know, the dollar is, is a big fear asset. Although people crying to the VIX, that's not really the fact. The fact is that the dollar, and the bonds are more fear, and bonds and notes are surging higher. So and we're still long. So, you know, who, who can complain? Okay. Uh, in the meantime, in the grain markets, they're getting hammered today. Corn down limit, uh, beans down 65, wheat down 30 cents. It's a, it's a big ugly in the, uh, in the grain markets. And, you know, look, at, we'll, we'll see what happens. You know, we are long corn, long beans, and short wheat. Uh, and that, you know, again, there's nothing I can do about it now. And, of course, we won't even evaluate it until after the close. And then the uh, the meats, you've got uh, cattle slightly higher, hogs higher, and uh, feeder cattle, which makes sense, obviously, with corn getting slaughtered. Uh, feeders are going to run because, of course, they feed they feed feeders. And, and that would be, you know, something that you would want to pay attention to. And in the sauce department, cotton has had a dramatic reversal this morning after being up over a dollar. Is now down 84. 
Uh, coffee's down three and we're short. We're, by the way, long cotton. Uh, sugar is down and we are long. Cocoa is down and we are short. And OJ is getting hammered and we're short. So overall, look, it's, the picture is mixed and it's a quiet day, which is not totally a surprise. So we will continue to watch. And again, we will, you know, update tomorrow with if we have any changes. And, you know, I don't know anything at the moment, but we will see tomorrow. In the meantime, don't forget about our other brokerage partner. And again, I remind you, I have other equity brokers as well. But the one we prefer is trade here. And listen, the first thing is the easiest thing to say is $10 a month. Okay. So you're taking money out of your pocket if you're trading anywhere else. But again, you have the right to do trade where you want. Uh, now, we do have their APIs, which allows us to automate our equity portfolios. And that is at no charge, no more commission and no more fee to us because, of course, that is part of your membership. And the, there is a fee for the hedging because that's a class, not a membership. But again, it's certainly well worth the ability to have something take care of things for you automatically. And uh, and, and they've got great customer service. So why wouldn't I want to be with Trader at $10 a month? Uh, our great partnership with Family Farms. And you know, look, at Family Farms has got the same goals we do, which is to help our farmers put themselves in the best positions. And we just want to make sure that we help them financially because they're busy doing the farming. And uh, our commodity report written by Andy Heck, Tech the Mental. Like I say, if you're not, if you're a commodities trader and, and you're not reading this, you are making a huge mistake. Uh, Tech the Mental is by far the best. You should see the quarterly reports that just came out. Uh, you got to check it out. Go to bubbatrading.com, call Tech the Mental. And of course, our high school program at Patreon, patreon.com forward slash Bubba Trading. That's P A T R E O N dot com forward slash Bubba Trading. In the meantime, have a great day today and uh, just be careful, be patient. And of course, the match is tonight with, uh, we're going with the Brady Mickelson team against DeChambeau and Rogers. Have a great day, everybody. We'll see you back here again tomorrow with another Bubba's Daily Update.